Let me show you how to remove a background on any picture inside of Canva. Jump into Canva here. I'm going to start with a YouTube thumbnail and I'm going to show you one more option on how to do this too after this using a different free app. But inside of Canva, if you create a YouTube thumbnail here, I'm going to press customize the thumbnail. And on the right side, I'm going to add a picture of myself here. And all you have to do is go to the upload tab on the left side, upload a file. And I took a screenshot here from a video. So I'm going to go ahead and upload this image here. And I'm going to click on this image to add this as soon as it's done uploading. And with this image here, the way you remove the background is you come to edit image here. And there is an option inside of Magic Studio called BG Remover. So you could go ahead and click on this and it will remove the background. I'm going to show you another option if you don't have this option, because I believe this option only comes with Canva Pro subscription, which I have. But if you do have Canva Pro and you have that option, you could go ahead and remove the background like this. If you don't have Canva Pro and you don't see BG Remover as one of the options on their Magic Studio, there is another free app. This is by Adobe, the company that makes Adobe Photoshop. So they're really, you know, the first people that ever allowed this to be an option. All you have to do is go to this website. I'll link this below and upload a photo here. This is free to use. No credit cards required. I'm not even logged in here. I'm going to take that image. Same thing. I'm going to upload that. Give it a second. And this is really, really clean. Now to use it inside of Canva, if you don't have, again, Canva Pro, just download this version, press download. And it's going to open this other app. You could actually make your thumbnails or any other design you have inside of Adobe Express. They also have ton of templates. So this is kind of a competitor to Canva and they have all kinds of different things you could do. Very similar to Canva. But if you go back to Canva now, if you don't have the same option, well, I just removed the background using Adobe. So I'm going to go ahead and upload that image. And that's a PNG file here. So it's uploading right here. So this one already doesn't have a background. So if I use it in my design this way, I don't actually have to use the tool, the background remover inside of Canva to do this. I could do it inside of that other website and then bring it in with the transparent background and drop it over here. I hope you found this video useful. I'll see you on the next one.